Hey, what's up, YouTube? Back with your boy, Luke. Hey, guys, check this out. It's October 30th. That means tomorrow, the 31st, Halloween night, Saturday night. We're having our party. We're having our get-together. It's going to start out at the Chicago Club around 7 o'clock. I'm going to be there. Just come on over. All right, guys, check this out. Two of my subscribers have been hitting me up about a couple of issues crossing the border, and I want to address those right now. The first issue being a few of my subscribers have been actually refused entry into Mexico due to the non-essential travel law or the non-essential travel rule, whatever you want to call it. Mexican immigration's talking to them and they're sending them back. Okay, guys, you got to come up with something. You're going to the dentist. You're going for weight loss surgery. You're going to see your daughter. You're going to see your wife. Your mom's in the hospital. I mean, guys, come on. Come up with something. If thousands of people are crossing that border every day, which they are, if you're down there, people are going and coming in every lane possible, and you're the one having a problem, then you are the problem. Step up. Level up your game, guys. You got to get some more trade to you. Come up with a line of BS. Number two. A couple of my subscribers are being hit with being taken by Mexican immigration into an office and they're saying you have to pay $30 or $20 for a tourist visa. They want to know what I think about that. Well, they're certainly not hitting me up for a tourist visa and I'd tell them right straight where they could put it. However, if you're going to be in the country for more than like, I think it's 30 days, or if you're going to go into the interior of Mexico, you're supposed to get that visa. And they, I've been charged for it a couple times when I went to Cancun or when I went to Mexico City. But normally I'm not. Okay, guys. So, what do you do if they hem you up and they tell you that you owe them 20 bucks for a tourist visa? Well, it's very simple. If you want to go across the border and you want to bang those hot chicks, then you need to pay the money. You just got to chalk that up to the cost of doing business in Mexico. I've said it a million times. Is it right? No. Do I condone it? No. But what are your options? Come on, guys. If you can't afford 20 or 30 extra dollars, to be honest with you, you don't have any business going to Mexico anyway, nor do you have any business watching YouTube. You need to go get another job. Bye, y'all.